Hey, it's Oliver. And Luca. And today we're going to be talking about how the Quest 1 situation has gotten even worse. Alright, so longtime viewers will know that we already kind of made a video about this same topic, but the difference is Meta themselves at this point have pretty much just killed the headset. It's not even just speculation anymore. Before we were just kind of saying what we thought's gonna happen and what is happening and etc etc. But we actually didn't think they would take it to this far. Yeah, dude, this point all. you just stabbed the headset, you threw it off a bridge, you murdered it. It dude, is meta it's pretty much useless now. Why would you do this to us? Like, actually, here's one of the first things they changed. No new features to Quest 1, which for all you guys who commented last video, all the it's old even though it's not that old well that's use it that's for expected arguments. like i didn't expect them to keep giving it new future features features even though, i get that but the heads that's isn't that old that's just the start but next we have no more parties you cannot talk outside of game chat you are stuck in game chat if which you speak is to by far the worst of them all, which I'm confused why you didn't save it for last, but <laughs> anyway, okay. that's a huge deal because you literally, you cannot talk to anybody outside of game chat at all. Imagine Nothing. trying to play with your friends on a game like Rec Room and you're across the map. What are you supposed to do? You're not talking to each other? That's the issue. It just doesn't really work. Without that feature, we will now have to use Discord or something. And for you, most of you guys who really like our live streams, those may not even be possible anymore because yep. of this. We may have to use a third party software like Discord on PC and that would really suck for everybody. And the next we have no horizon home features, which is who cares, it was cool. It was actually really cool, especially if you wanted to do meetings. Like if you were in a work environment, definitely that would have been helpful, but uh, they removed it. So yeah, whatever. It, that's fine. That's some of the stuff where it's like, oh, those are new features. I get it. W why'd you give it to us, though? And then remove it immediately. That is kind of annoying. And, like I said before, this is my issue. This is my big issue with this. Like, everything else, if those had an excuse, if someone could be like, oh, because of this, I'd be like, all right, that sucks. But I'm not making a video about it. I'm making a video about it. Because Meta's doing this on purpose to force you to get rid of your Quest 1. Exactly. They are doing it on purpose. They're getting rid of the Oculus entirely. They want to kill off Oculus, which sucks because Oculus is a better name than Meta. And also, they're just really pushing it. Like, honestly, they are really pushing it. It's stupid because right now, every single one of those features works perfectly fine. You can have a party chat, no problem. It's not like there was a bug or something or it's like overloading their servers. Which, and like there's no issue with it so what they're doing now is they're literally removing more features that are already on it which doesn't make any sense at all it's really stupid it honestly really sucks to like everyone like i spent 500 dollars on this freaking headset and now it's useless all my games are being taken off like i paid for that it's not like oh it was like a small price like, it wasn't like the headset was super cheap that you would just throw it away after three years. Like, I don't care. I hate planned obsolescence, and this is to the worst. Like, even Apple, known for their products dying in, a, in like a year. My phone uh, has been around. Uh, I had an iPhone 7 in the past, and I had it like for over five years. Yeah, it got old, it got like slower. They didn't remove features on it. That's not how it works. They don't have to do that. It's like one day they just put an update. Sorry, you can no longer call on your phone. You can no longer FaceTime your friends now on Apple products if you have a uh, generation 13 below. <laughs> okay, interesting uh, explanation. But uh, anyway, you get the point. So it kind of sucks. And Doesn't for those of you me. that like that in our channel, our VR stuff and our content about all of it, I don't know how much more there's going to be, and if there is, it might not be very often because it's going to be a pain to try and figure out, as well as the fact that we don't really feel like going on there. Well, I, I, how, love, like, I love VR. Like, it is my me favorite too. gaming platform. My, I prefer, it if someone told me, get rid of all your consoles, except the one, your, except the one I, that you will constantly get, like, provided with. 
Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> if someone said, give me all your consoles except your favorite one, I would keep the quest. If obviously, if I had a newer quest that wasn't dying every two seconds. Like, I love that. When I opened it out of the box, that was my first Instagram post in months. That was one of the coolest things ever. I loved the Quest one. It's awesome. And it's still a great headset, but it's just, we don't really feel like going on there when we literally can't even talk in a party. Yeah. Like, like, whoa, what is that? Yeah. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Now we have to put on, I guess, headphones and connect to Discord or something yeah. else, because, like, I don't know. That's just, it doesn't make any sense, because it's already, it's there. You can still use that it's if right. you can literally talk with people right now on a party. It's like Why did they take it away? It's like if someone gave you, like, an ice cream as, like, sorry, ice creams aren't provided anymore, and they take it back. Yeah. Like, it's like bro, you already gave it to me. You gave it to me. It's there. There's no issues with my you ice did. cream. Why are you taking away my ice cream? You jerk? I, li I like the explanation. I'm so, genuinely really pissed. It is. It like, sounds like we're making like you know like we're not as mad. But when we first discovered it, I mean, I was absolutely so. I pissed was off. planning on going to Facebook headquarters and like pooping on Mark Zuckerberg's deck. <laughs> Dex. <laughs> Dex. Yes. Okay. Dex. Anyway, so we thought we'd make a short video. We sound, you know. I guess lighthearted, you could say, because we're kind of, uh, you know, making a video. It's the point. But, like, like, we are really not happy about this. And it really sucks. Incredibly, legitimately pissed. <laughs> no, freaking don't. I'm at the top of my lungs. <laughs> Sounds like Mario just dying. Quickly before we end this, however, I want to go talk about some of the comments we got on the last one and people who didn't understand it. Now, people who bought the Quest 2 are saying, quickly coming to Meta's defense, saying things like, hey, uh, it's old software. Who cares anymore? Dude, like I said earlier in this video, that software is only three, year old, three years old. Like, what is it? Life has the life of a freaking hamster or something? Like, bro, that doesn't make any sense. You Especially for the price point, it being more expensive than the 2. Dude. I convinced Oliver to get it. He was so excited, and it caught- Two months like, later, the Quest 2 came out. Yeah, and he was like annoyed, because he's like, oh, it's so much, but it looks so cool, I have to get it. Then out of nowhere, they do this. And then, like, bro, Oliver hasn't even had it for like, what, two or three years? I haven't had it for very long, at yeah. all. I've had it since launch. And as someone who supported, well, supported Meta ever since they bought, or Facebook ever since they bought Oculus, I'm really disappointed. I'm honestly really annoyed. Uh, we're being really lighthearted here, but I'm gonna be honest, I'm really not happy about this. I hope they change it, but there's no way they will. They're not going to. Really it's, it's, sorry. It sucks. For, really sorry for everyone who has a Quest 1. They're pulling tell the plug us on if, it. Tell us if you still have one. I don't even know how many people have them. Maybe anymore. everyone got rid of it. Maybe it's just an us problem. Regardless, it's still really stupid. It's incredibly stupid. But we'll see you guys next time. Don't commit tax fraud in Mark Zuckerberg's basement. He doesn't do his taxes anyways, so. See you guys later. Bye.